Whoa! 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 I am styling and profiling. Alex Impact is in one of the best moods he has been in in a very long time. You see, the night of Death and Honor, the night after Death and Honor, and the night after that, and the night after that. The inner circle has been partying like you all know. Only we can. We have been going out to the clubs, the fancy restaurants, and we have been just going crazy. Crazy. We have been doing the damn thing, if you know what I'm saying. You see, the reason why that is, is for a few things. Let me explain to you what they are. One. I was thinking about ending it all. I was thinking about never tying up the boots again, never lacing them up, never stepping into the ring. I was so down in the dumps about being sick, I was thinking I may never recover. But no. No. I persevered, and I stayed strong, thanks to A.G. Vito, and of course, the encouragement from all of the SWA fans. You see, when I persevere, I persevere. Not like, um, say, you people, who just give up after a little while, because... You can't do it. Oh, no. Golly gee. Sorry. I'm better. And I do things when I please. And next. This is very important, so listen closely. Next. We did something that a lot of people said we could never do. We beat those Brits clean. Yes, in the middle of the ring. One, two, three. And it felt so liberating. Oh, some might say it was a bit of a cheap win. The ref didn't see that his feet were on the ropes. I, I don't know. I, I think the ref got a pretty good look. And if there was a rope break, the ref would have called it. I'm sorry, folks, but you can't break out the rule book for this time. Maybe for the last match, but not for this one. And on top of that, the third thing. The match that we had at the last CPV, some say, was a match of the year candidate. But the ending dropped it down a star. Oh no! Well, for all of the SWA fans, there you go. We gave you one better. And I heard at the taping, Paul Play-by-Play -play said, Well, I like the Brits. Well, you know, he had to correct himself because he's a fickle person, but he also understands that if I heard him say that, if I was an earshot, he would have been put through a table. So he corrected himself and he said, Well, I actually like both teams. And that was a smart move by you, play-by-play. -play. Because, one, there are only two teams in SWA right now. And two, we won. So what does that make us? Oh, yes! I know what that makes us. The best team in CAW today. You can't dispute it. You can't argue it. You can't say anything to deny it. It is fact. 
and we are going to be partying all week, all night, all day. Because we have beaten all of the competition. No, the only competition. Sure, the Brits are good, but we beat them. And that makes us the best. And you can throw any other team that you want at us, Gluteus. You can bring in any team from YTCW, YLLWA, MWE, doesn't matter. The fact of the matter is, you can take all of those teams from the past, the present, and the future, and stick them up your ass. Because the inner circle is not only better than the rest, we are better than the best. Peace. And enjoy the show. Gentlemen to SWA Warzone. It is I, the Patriot, and yes, I am alone with no Michelle Saint. That is right, there is no Michelle Saint. There is no bisexual Canadian sitting next to me who has cousins that live in Perian blood. And now, let's 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 get on with the card, shall we? We've got Michelle Saint going up against Hannah, which I know she's gonna lose. And then we've got a match, a qualifier for. The Royal Rumble, which is going to be happening soon. It's going to be Damian Dynamite trying to go up against RKO Kid. We have never seen Damian Dynamite, but this is going to be the first. Then we've got a qualifier for the icy title for the next war zone, which is Skittle Zone versus Munitron. And then the main event of the evening, a battle royal. A big battle royal to determine the number one contender for the SWA title at the Royal Rumble, and it's going to contain RTK, Mutant, Johnny Thunder, The Masterpiece, and, um, give it away. Anyhow, let's get on with the first match, which Michelle, I guarantee, is going to lose. 